What is a word equation? Hi, I'm Jimmy Chang. I've been teaching college math for nine years. And when it comes to a word equation, we're basically talking about using words to help you set up an equation. Now, if that sounds like awfully like a word problem, it actually is. Uh, you actually use words, though, to logically set up an equation. And when it comes to doing word problems, setting it up is always going to be the hardest part. Because doing it, once you have the equation, is pretty darn straightforward. So here's an example as to how you would make a word equation, and I'll let you solve the rest. So here we go. For example, you have 3 less than twice a number is 13. What is the number? So first off, let's address the word problem in pieces. If you can tackle the word problem piece by piece, it's a lot less overwhelming than if you were to tackle the word problem as a whole. Oftentimes, when people wor read word problems as a whole, they tend to give, give up too quickly. But if you look at it phrase by phrase, it's going to work out much better for you. So take a look at 3 less than. Now, it might be tempting to write the less than symbol here, but 3 less than actually means that there's going to be subtraction going on. That will always going to be the case. So 3 less than means minus 3. Now let's talk about the second phrase, twice a number. Now, twice a number, when you do something twice, you do something two times. Again, two times. That sounds pretty easy all of a sudden, doesn't it? Two times a number, you just write it as multiplication. So it'd be two times, let n be the number, 2n. So now one side is going to be 2n minus 3. Is. Is is always going to be the equal sign. Always. And of course, you now know what number is on the other side, which is 13. So what is the number? Well, it's your job now to basically solve for it. So if you want to solve it together, basically you want to get n by itself. Solving it, you have to get rid of the 3. Add 3 to both sides. So you now have 2n equal to the 3's negative 3 and positive 3 cancel. 13 plus 3 is 16. And then to solve for n, Divide both sides by 2, and you'll have n equal to 8. So I'm Jimmy Chang, and that's an example as to how to solve a word equation.